Hi, I'm Jasmine. And I'm Kevin. And welcome to, to Hidden, Hidden Acres, Acres Homestead. Homestead. In this episode, we're going to be putting a new sight glass and resealing the hydraulic tank on the 941B cat track loader behind us. Um, we're really looking forward to this machine being going so we can get in and tidy this place up. So the first thing we've got to do, we've already got the oil out of it. We've removed some other pipes and stuff for some other jobs we've got to do. We've got to undo all of these bolts around the side so we can get this side off because the sight glass is replaced internally. The tools we're going to be using today, just a 3.8 rattle gun, don't need anything too big. Um, 3.8 socket set which just got an extension and a 9.16 socket. Uh, helping us out with this today, we've got my, our eldest son Dean. He's brought some of his new little tools along. We've got some magnetic trays that uh, stop us losing the bolts. So um, we'll just keep undoing bolts. Can you say hi to everyone? Hi. got all the bolt fun done, bar one. We're just going to try and split the tank away now and see what we've got inside. Don't tell me there's a hose connected inside. Okay, we've just got a hose inside we've got to remove to let us get the outer shell off. Runs back to the filter. Okay, we've got that hose off. Now the outer shell can come away. We can clean up inside, clean up the gasket, replace the sight glass, and um, start putting it back together. A bit of gunk to clean out there now. Okay, now we just got to clean it all up. We've got a little bit of surface rust and stuff inside. We're going to buff it off with the um, wire brush. Um, going to clean all this gunk out of the bottom. Have it all nice and clean so the components will last as long as we can get them to last. Alright, we'll be back when we're ready to replace the sight glass in this outer half. This is the backing of the sight glass. Now we're going to take off the sight glass. This is the backing of it here. So we just got the four nuts to take off. the backing we've got a new one of those this is the glass and the rubber just got a chippy 
getting off. You can see why it was a little bit hard to see through. Okay, just gonna give that a quick clean. Now to get our new parts. This is our new backing plate. Our new seal. And our new glass. Let me just pop that inside there. And that pops inside there. Now as you can see, it's all nice and clean. Now we have to fit our gasket. Could you tell us what a gasket is, please? Gasket's just a seal that goes between the two metal surfaces. To stop any leakage, correct? Yep. So we have our gasket, they put these neat little round tubes to stop them creasing and splitting. That just folds out. Should look very similar to our tank. Like that. Okay. Alright, we're going to use a bit of gasket sealer on there. We'll be back shortly. This stuff I bought at the shop. Audio Dino.
Right, what we're going to do is we're going to aim to put that hole there on that bolt. Yeah, you guide it, I'll lift it. Dad's just connecting up the hose in the hydraulic tank. Then we've got to seal it off, and then we'll all be done. And thank goodness for that, because it's killer hot out here. Do you need to push on that? Uh. So that we don't stuff the gasket, we're going to put in a couple bolts spaced around to make sure we're not hitting the gasket with the bolts when we put them in. Okay, that's the tank sealed back up. We're going to come back later. We're going to rip the filters out and check some numbers and make sure we got the right ones. So we can order them for next time. Righto, we hope you found today's video helpful. Um, stay tuned for more repairs on the track loader. And give us a hand by sharing our videos to help our channel grow. See ya!